Where do, we, where do we start after that game? From 2 0 down to 2 2, and it looked like Chester won it late on, but this Bradford side just doesn't want to quit, does it? No, I mean, I think it, it's, you know, it shows how far we've come that we're disappointed. You know, to come off the pitch at, at 3 all and have not won against a team who are second in the league. You know, um, I think I think come strong, like last sort of 10, 20 minutes, of, I think those sort of players who, who press well, you know, like Sir Jacobs, Isaac, uh, Clear. His right ball age is good at it as well, and I think we come strong, and I think that's where we um, sort of grow into games week in week out. Um, and yeah, like I say, we're just disappointed to come off with a with a draw, really. I mean, it really does speak volumes for the character the character of this Bradford side, doesn't it? You know, the heads could have dropped after that dubious penalty, arguably. Then going into half time, two 0 down. What did what did the manager say to you at half time? Did he say, right, we might just have to suck this one up, or? Come on, we can still get back at this. Um, to be fair, we had a bit of an inquest ourselves. Um, obviously, we weren't really disappointed in the performance. It was more um, just how we can get back in the game, second half, and kind of, you know, we knew if we got a goal, early doors. We didn't even have to be early doors, you know. We said just be patient, keep doing what we're, what we're good at, moving the ball, and we'll get a goal. And obviously, that's how, it, that's how it's panned out, and uh, obviously, getting back to 2 2. Um, obviously, we feel we should have won it. I should have scored. Um, Luke's had a chance, Clear's had a couple of openings, um, but yeah, we'll take a point. I mean, it, it says a lot now that we're, we're playing teams who are really happy in the division. We're talking about Boston last week, and, and tonight we're feeling that we should have come away with three points. Um, you, you blame yourself, you could have scored late on. We hit the side netting twice, and from the, yeah. from the media <clears throat> position, it almost looked like we'd, we'd scored a winner. How frustrating was that later on? Yeah, I think, like you say, week in, week out, we're, we're competing with the big teams, the so called big teams in the league. To see the Boston game, um, and we've done it all season. I think we've sort of, part, um, you know, as better showings we've been against the top teams. So um, yeah, like I say, we've had our chances. Um, but yeah, it's a point. We'll build on it. Um, obviously, we'll take it in Saturday. Another, another top team, Kidderminster, flying full time, and you know, they're the games we relish. Really, they've got um, you know a lot of young lads in the change rooms, and you know, they're really um, these are the games that we'll be playing in. Um, well, obviously, for as long as we can. Obviously, fingers crossed, even continues. But yeah, I mean, we're pleased with ourselves, pleased with showing, and like I say, it shows how far we've come that we're we're disappointed with the point. Even though you know, obviously going three two down, you know, we'll, uh, we're happy with the point. And just uh, just a word on Lewis Knight. Obviously, a goal scorer this evening. Sadly, went off injured shortly after. What exactly happened with that injury? Was it was it in, uh, during the goal he scored or the celebration? He was feeling his groin at half time. So I just said to him, look, you you get us uh, back at game, then you can go off. Get if you've got your players, then you can then you can go off. And it, it milked it a bit, didn't it? Really. Now I'm only kidding. Obviously, we we all lose is all right. He's a massive player for us. He's, a, he's an absolute threat. His pace is electric. And then, yeah, I mean, hopefully it's not not too serious for him. Well, I think if there's one thing that you showed in the second half is that you can you can more than make do without him. As much as a, a loss he is, everybody stepped up in that second half. So uh, congratulations, a hard fought point, but well done all the same. Cheers, mate.